Hello and welcome back to Stardew Valley. We have a wonderful day planned for today. We're going to go see Glunther and uh, check on all of our little artifacts here, see what they, they do. But first, let's see what the weather will be like tomorrow. Oh my goodness, shocker. Beautiful sunny day. What about the spirits? Shall we also, upon seeing Gunther, go north to Clint and get our geodes broken open? We don't want to do it when there's just a little bit of extra luck. We want a lot of bit of extra luck. Now, it's Living Off the Land with Jim Livingston. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. Let's talk corn. It's an unusual crop because it lasts for two seasons. That's right, folks. While most crops die when the season changes, corn lives on. You can grow it in both summer and the fall. Now get out there and you plant some corn, you silly pants. Thank you, Jim. What a guy. You know, he's retired. He does that for fun. I mean, it's amazing, isn't it? <gasps> Yay, peppers. Don't you want to be a pepper too? Da, 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 da. Good morning, Yogi. Good morning. Ah, don't you run away from me. I love you. Pepper, pepper, pepper. Pepper, pepper, pepper. Oh, those peppers. If you go to Italy, and in my case, it's when I went to China, and you sit down in a place that's predominantly not visited by many English, like, like American English speaking individuals, and you order a pepperoni pizza, they will bring you a pizza with red, green, and yellow peppers on it because when you say pepperoni they look up the italian translation and it of course is peppers if you want the pepperoni that we're familiar with here in the states i forget what you have to say but when i was in china i made that mistake and i went to a restaurant that was called the western restaurant and they specialized in western food and i thought it was funny because they treated um french fries as a entree so as we sat down to order i knew i wanted pizza like i just i was hungry for pizza i love pizza and um i saw on the menu they had like the entree section and french fries were there and apparently the, a lot of people in the village loved oh look at that beautiful i don't know what is this a poppy cool i kind of want to plant another poppy to tell you the honest truth because it looks so pretty um they, yeah, they had french fries as entree. And apparently those are very, very, very big deal uh, in China. People love um, french fries. Like, they'll they'll order it by the table. Like, they'll just say, bring me all the french fries you have. But as I sat down to eat, I ordered a pepperoni pizza. And got, um, got a pizza with a bunch of this stuff on it. And I ate it because I was hungry. All right. So we can sell those seven. And we're going to put the flower in the flower pot, uh, flower deal over here, just in case, uh, you know, we want to keep all the flowers from the different seasons in here, just in case someone like really likes flowers for their birthday, then we'll have it for them. Uh, but let's go over here. We're going to sell that. I guess if we needed to, we could sell the chicken because I can, I see we can sell these artifacts. So if we get another chicken we don't want to decorate our house with it. Did we uh, did we put water in the dogs? We did. Perfect. Okay. Let's go grab these uh, sweet peas. This is where I, I think I found the grape up here somewhere. I hope we get more grapes. It would be nice if every now and then something actually fell out of the tree that we hit. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure it's not Gus's birthday. Like I'm, I'm almost 100% sure that it... Uh, we should have brought that ghost fish in from and turned in the ghost fish. That's something that we have to do. We always forget that. I think we have wheat. That's Elliot. That's the guy who lives on the beach. Don't you worry, Elliot. It is his birthday today. Crisis mode. Crisis mode. Oh, crap. Okay. Everybody calm down. I just gotta, I just gotta find out what this guy likes. Let's see. Where's my Reddit? Where's my Reddit? Hold on, everybody. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, really, this guy? 
He's making YouTube videos and he doesn't even know what the crap he's doing. He's got to look at his, you know, look at his phone. You're correct. Again, this is by, uh, oh dear. According Juice, 8363, he put together this lovely little cheat sheet. Um, crap, where is Gus on here? The only bad thing is that this lovely cheat sheet uses caricatures that don't 100% look quite exactly like the individuals in the game like I can't I don't see Gus on here I don't see Gus oh okay I see Gus now okay Gus likes um, tacos pizza a rabbit's foot an orange a diamond like you're gonna get that for your freaking birthday and then rainbow cake he also likes a beer man I can't he likes a parsnip it looks like it looks like he likes a parsnip and a potato is that a potato it looks like a potato Gus likes parsnips and potatoes P and P all right Gus I know you I know where you work don't you worry don't you worry, we're going to run all the way back home, we're going to grab a parsnip and, and a potato, we're going to get the ghost fish, we're going to come into town, we're going to, we're going to make, we're going to give you a happy birthday, Gus, and then we're going to turn in our ghost fish. Woo! Oh, man. Almost screwed the poop on that one. Alright, ghost fish. Alright. Ghost fish. Ghost fish. Some say that ghost fish is still a ghost today i don't know um i'm gonna go ahead and give away one of my really why do i have so many potatoes do five sell the other four uh can i can i just can i do one uh perfect perfect all right Let's go find Gus. Let's go give Gus a potato. And then we'll go to Gunther, turn our stuff in. Actually, we're going to go to Gunther first. Actually, we're going to go to the community center, then then Gunther. And then we're going to go to... Uh, to see. Because Gus doesn't even like wake up until 12 in the afternoon. He runs the, uh, he runs the tavern. He's probably sloshed from last night. Buddy Rabbit! I saw you. Remember, this is our, our goal here. This is what we're trying to do. This is our... Oops. We're trying to get all this to brought back to life, so... I don't think we're doing a great job of... Oh, we shouldn't have sold all those peppers. Hello, young lady. How are you, Abigail? My pet guinea pig, David, just hates his hot weather. He's fussy. Well, I hate to hear that. It's probably because he has a fur coat on, you know what I mean? Ba da da dum, ba da da dum, bum ba da da. Sweet pea. I want grapes. Alright, Gunther. Donate to the museum. We're gonna donate this. New reward. Told you. Told you we were due. And glass. Beautiful. Dose rewards. Dose rewards, folks. Let's talk to the man. Let's collect them. Star fruit seed. Plant these in the summer. Takes 13 days to mature. Chicken. Okay. Uh, yes. How deep do the mines go? The question has been pondered by many Stardew... Va I found a book, by the way, in the, the episode that I lost. The question has been pondered by many Stardew Valley explorers over the years. The truth is, no one really knows, or at least they aren't telling anyone. Unfortunately, many of those venturing deep into the mines never return. Rip. However, there have been a few bold adventurers who have traveled deep into the mines and have resurfaced with interesting reports. Apparently, there are three distinct areas in the mine, each with a unique monster and treasures. Some adventurers 
speak of gigantic underground lakes and strange creatures, but none of these claims have been proven. I am pretty much 100% convinced that we have on our person, we have on our person a book that goes right here, but I don't know how to turn it in. You saw how there was a book up here and you went and you clicked on it, right? That's because we found the book. The book is in our possession, but I mean, I, I, I just assume that we have, I don't know. I don't know. Let's go. Let's go figure out what this stuff is. We turned in today. That it just irritates me seeing it. I just don't like it. Let's not water it. Palm fossil. Palm fossils are relatively common, but this happens to be a particularly well-preserved specimen. Rare disc. A heavy black disc studded with particular red stones. When you hold it, you're overwhelmed with a feeling of dread. Holy crap! Glass shards, a mixture of glass shards smoothed by centuries of ocean surf. These could have belonged to an ancient mosaic or necklace. Beautiful. Beautiful. I mean, I went into the sciences when I went to college. Um. Oh, dude, are you open? Oh, we don't, I don't... Why does everything cost so much money here? Like beer's three hundred dollars, ice cream's two hundred and fifty dollars. Oh, I oh Elliot wanted the wheat too. Poop, poop. I know, I know. You were all yelling at me when I ran back home. You're like, get the wheat, get the wheat. We're gonna go back home. We're gonna grab the wheat, and then we're gonna go find Gus. Oh my God, it's already two o'clock. I better be able to give him his birthday present while he's working. Where's the potato? There it is. And I'm going to get this thing in the ground because it takes 13 days. Hey, hey, dog. I saw that, Yogi. Oh, Yogi. You mess up my freaking plants. I'm right in a right right kisser. All right. Summer. He wants wheat. Ha 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 ha. All right. Bunny rabbit. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Where are you at, Gus? I thought that was Gus, by the way. I thought that was... Bunny rabbit! Is that our girl? Is that Penny? I think we're going to go for Penny. I think our this will be Penny's playthrough. That's Jody. Ew, Jody. No offense to girls named Jody. Need a hot meal? I certainly don't. But you, my friend, need a birthday present. Look at this, a freaking potato. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Oh, man. That feels great. Is that Penny? Uh, Penny? Nope. I'm Maru. You Penny? Nope. We'll find Penny. All right, let's go find the guy who lives on the beach. Elliot. Anytime I hear the word Elliot, the name Elliot, I just think the guy from, uh, uh, oh, whoa, is that, is there an Elliot in Zootopia? No, it's Nick. <gasps> Dried starfish. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey, you kids, look at that. You're playing on the beach. How cute. You really should have an adult. Like, you you should not be down here without supervision. More worms. A book. <laughs> there, is that the bubbles? No. Let's see if we can see the bubbles right quick enough. Nope, no bubbles. That's okay. Don't worry. Elliot lives on the beach. All right, we're ambushing him. He comes home, we're just gonna blammo, we're gonna get him. Don't you worry. Yeah, see, we know where he lives. He has to come back home. You know what I mean? And when he comes back home, we got him. It would be nice to know where he's at right now, but no one really knows. Maybe, maybe he's in here now. Look, look, look. Pam's here. Does Abigail work here? Hey, Pam. Yeah, you got it, kid, uh, lady. 
Hey, I don't say it. Oh, did I say Abigail? I don't remember. Emily is the one where we had the psychedelic dream with. You guys remember how freaking weird that was? Wow. Okay. We gotta be on the lookout for Elliot. Operation. Operation where the crud is Elliot. Has begun. We will sit here vigilant. Well, hold on, let me just make sure he's not. I mean, maybe he's home. Maybe he's home. Maybe he snuck in. Okay, you're not at home. Not at home. All right. We're just going to sit and wait right here. And the best thing to do while you're sitting and waiting to give somebody some hay, you guessed it. I really thought that I was going to be in the mines the entire time. I was like, I am a mine person, combat oriented. I'm going to be in the mines. But the fishing, ah. Oh, Love the fishing. Except when I get a stupid piece of garbage. Ah, that's what we want. We want a fish. Oh, this is a feisty fish. Very clever. Very cunning. Ah! Wow. Pike. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. That is a, I think a new species. I think a new species. Man, that was rough. Hey, Elliot. <laughs> Hold on. Let's make sure we're talking to Elliot. We're talking to Elliot. Hey, brother. Woo. Hey, hey, hey. No problem. 75 gold. Day nada. Day nada. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, buddy? Day nada. All right. Community center. Uh, dried starfish. I assume that's the ocean. That's the ocean. Ocean fish bundle. We only need what? A red snapper. We got to catch the octopus and the blowfish during uh during this season because you can't catch them just whenever you want. We gotta knuckle down. Okay, so you aren't. Oh, you're an artifact. Oh, I should have read that. I should have read that. Okay, well, we have something more to turn into Gunther. And we have a little chicken decoration. I guess we can put in our house. Well, it's 7.30. Might as well cruise on back home. Maybe we'll cut down a tree or two. Get some more lumber going. We're going to need a lot of lumber. We're going to need a lot of the hard wood to get, uh, to get the upgrade. Like the chicken coop. Yes, sirree. Yes, sirree. Let's see, here we are back home. Where's our flower chest? You are flower chest, yep. Boop, boop. You are our water chest. Love it. We're going to do that tomorrow. We're going to go into the house right now. We're going to put our chicken down. So we can have it to look at. Welcome, chicken. Beautiful chicken. Beautiful. Okay, can't pet dog. Dog is asleep at 8.30. That's weird. All right, let's get out of here in the spooky, spooky woods at 9 o'clock at night, and let's cut down some crap. I also need to get up there and, and get all those stones cleared out at one point. That's something that needs to get done. Yep. Do I have a lot of energy? I do have a lot of energy. I have a lot of energy and I have a lot of time. Perfect. Perfect combination. Piece of wood right there. Perfect. And let's just try to get all this cleaned up. Oh, I love the bird sounds. 
You know what? I wouldn't mind a game where you go bird hunting, like sightseeing for birds, what do they call that? <clears throat> Sorry, I don't mean to clean, clear my throat in your ear. Uh, bird watching is what they call it. Be a pretty cool thing. We're just going to clear all... I mean, we don't need the stone, but we're going to clear all this out just so... Uh, just so that more things will spawn in here. More things that might benefit us better than the stone. Did I craft things for free? All right, we have some a paved path now. I want to do a paved path here where the trees are growing. I guess I just gotta wait till it rains for that to turn back into like regular deal. Just bring this over. Okay. Ah, it's starting. It's starting. And I come over here to the seed chest. That is not the seed chest. Seeds and flowers. Oop, oop. Nope, that goes into industry. So that and that go in there. And then coal goes into there. Um, yeah, everything looks great. Oh, we have six geodes. Wow, we have many geodes. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, all right. Hey, everything looks great, and it's 11 o'clock. I guess that's going to be our episode for today. That puts us right at about 22 minutes. Okay, I'm all right with that. Hey, folks, again, I'm so sorry that I lost the uh, I'm so sorry that I lost those two days. The uh, Friday, Saturday. That's completely my fault. Um, I need to just have a little checklist here and just say, you know, hey, check the inputs and make sure they look good. Oh no, did you guys not be? No, okay, you can hear the sound. Huh. Okay. Um, yeah, have a great day, folks. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. Oh, 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 we're supposed to go to sleep. That's right, that's right. We go to sleep so that you can see how much money we make. Hey, level six farming, plus one water can proficiency, plus one hoe proficiency. New crafting recipe, hard wood fence, cool. New crafting recipe, cheese press, yeah. And a quality sprinkler. Perfecto, perfecto, love it. 580 bucks on stinking peppers. I love that, love that. Day nine of summer, progress has been saved. I am super curious. What does a quality sprinkler entail? Of course, refined quartz, gold bar, and iron. Boop. That's, that's a little bit out of our league. Anyway, folks, have a great day, and we will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.